Hey friends, and thanks for joining us this morning as we take a deep breath together. The other day, my wife and I got to explore New York City with our dog, Chloe. Uh, she's, she's a special pup, so we took her on her own special tour of the Met, Central Park, and just about every major landmark in the city. And one thing to know about Chloe is that she's, she's more of a couch and snuggle kind of dog than a walk and explore kind of dog. We got two steps through our tour before she decided she was tired and done walking. This dog literally stops and lay down in the middle of a busy Manhattan intersection. And she just looked up at me with eyes that basically said, if we're gonna go any further, you're gonna have to carry me. And so that's exactly what I did. I scooped her up into my hands, loaded her into my backpack, and we continued on our journey through the city. I'll say, uh, I think Chloe got the best end of that deal and my back might still be hurting from it. Friend, can, can I ask you a question? Are you feeling tired today? Do you sometimes wake up in the morning wondering if you have the energy to, to carry yourself through the day? If so, I, I just believe that God wants to speak these words from Isaiah 46 over you. Here's what he says. He says, even, even to your old age and gray hairs, I am he. I am he who will sustain you. I have made you and I will carry you. I will sustain you and I will rescue you. If you, if you walked into this morning and the long list of things to do in front of you just seems exhausting, God wants to sustain you. If you're on your third cup of coffee right now, just trying to get enough energy to chase the kids, complete the chores, get to work on time and not let anyone around you down, God sees you. If you're if you're feeling ready to just give up and throw in the towel, God is saying, I'll lift you up and I'll carry you. He's gonna get you through today and he's gonna carry you into tomorrow. So can you do this? Can you open up your hands as we breathe and pray together? As you do that, I, I want you to visualize God actually filling up your cup, not with coffee or, or caffeine, but with his presence. I want you to just take a deep breath and pray with me. Lord, you sustain me. Today, will you carry me? Let's try it again. Lord, you sustain me. Today, will you carry me? Once more. Lord, you sustain me. Today, will you carry me? Let's pray together. Lord, thank you for your promise. Your promise that you will sustain us and that you'll carry us even when we feel like we don't have the strength and energy to do it ourselves. You know us because you created us. And so we ask you to fill our cups like no one else can and like only you can. We pray this in Jesus' name, amen. May you breathe deep today and know that the God of the universe is ready to pick you up at a moment's notice. When you feel tired, he will sustain you. When you can't take another step, he will lift you up into his arms. He'll put you onto his back and he will carry you. And check this out, unlike me, he won't grow tired of doing it. Can't wait to see you tomorrow.